Hello everyone, Kirby Volt here, and welcome back to Let's Play Bastion Blind. On the last episode, we had just returned from getting a core, and then I talked to Rux, I talked to Zolf, and he was like, Hey buddy, I have a pipe, and then we took a whiff of the pipe, and that was probably not a smart thing to do, and that let us down memory lane for the kid. A lot of stuff went on there, and we didn't get to see all the memories, but we got to see most of them. Now, we're finally back in the Bastion, and let's actually take care of stuff that we should have done last time, like making something with that core. We can make a memorial, or a shrine. The shrine is the stuff that would, uh, make the game harder. Um... I'd rather make the memorial, to be honest. I am kind of more of a sentimental person, so I'd prefer that first before we make the shrine. Me memorial. New vigils, uh, vigils available. Alright. The memorial. Here a kid can pay respect to the old world and earn it in kind. Construct the memorials of Salandia. Okay, so these are kind of like quests you can do, essentially. Neat. Earn glory points and proving grounds. Earn first prize and require in the required number of proving grounds. Alright. Gain the required number of mementos strewn across the countryside. Alright, I have 9 out of 15 so far. Nice. Uh, I have 7 out of 20 of the secret skills. Restore the land piece by piece. Re Raise the required number of land pieces through travel and exploration. Okay. I'm not really sure what those are, but okay. Um, the Mercy. Vanquished creatures touched by the Calamity. Defeat the required number of different species of beasts. Okay, we're working on that. Show surpassing skill with the Scrap Musket. Defeat ten or more foes in a single well-placed shot. Okay, well that's easy enough. Okay, so these are... Alright, let's see. The Masons. Show surpassing skill with a uh, sail hammer. Deliver a single crushing blow for at least 70 damage. Okay. Defeat a hardy foe with the last bolt in a clip. Okay, so these are kind of neat. Oh, wait. No, uh, I guess this one. The Valediction. Just another one of my sketches. Nothing more. Okay, so we, we technically did have one because we built the memorial. Words can't express what happened, but they're all I got. So let's see, we can upgrade the musket. Let's do that. Uh, plus fifty range, minus fifty spread. That's kind of dumb, but okay. Uh, special. You want to tune a scrap musket? You start with the barrel. And let's do. We don't. We can't have that because we don't have uh, anything for that. But we can. Upgrade some of this stuff, even though we don't really use... We don't use that one, so... Something burnt. We still have that one, though, so that's interesting. Whatever the burnt one is. And at the arsenal, we do have the scrap musket. It is nice. However, I'm going to switch back to our loyal companion, the Thang Repeater. And uh, we're not going to take a whiff of that pipe, because that did bad stuff. Anything at the lost and found before we go out? Final warning. Uh, a blast sent straight up into the air, causing a flurry of projectiles to rain down the area. Um, let's see. Something nasty. I would like... I don't have anything for... I'll take this, though. Finders keepers. And... Uh, yeah, that's... Oh, whale ale. Oh, that reminds me. There's one other thing we need to do before we leave. We need to go to the distillery because I've leveled up. So we have... What's Bastion Bourbon? Uh, health tonics, fully restore health, plus two... Oh, snap! Yes! Yes, please! If you low, count on the buttery flavor of our own Bastion Bourbon. And we'll upgrade the Fang Repeater. Let's see, plus 50 damage, plus 50%. Eh, that's not too bad. We don't really need... We don't really need that. This is much better. That ought to make those fangs sink in nice and deep. Okay, now that we have, uh mucked around here enough. Well, what's out in the overworld? Um... Alright, we have... Oh, well, we have a, we have a sail hammer proving ground now. Alright, we only have the Langston River. That's the Langston River. Used to cut all the way to the wild. Think it was bad then. Well, let's find out. It was last seen halfway down the riverbank in the shadow of Prosper Bluff. The Langston River flowed free and wild till the Calamity drank it all up. Is that a new type of enemy? 
Maybe all that water just grew wings and flew off. Alright, let's get some of those. Materials are always good to have. That's why destroying stuff is actually kind of useful, because having these materials to upgrade stuff and buy stuff. Always good. And there's Prickle Brush. Let's get rid of that. Before it becomes an issue. And reload. Oh, a lot of it today. Wow, I wish I had that. I wish I had leveled up last time, so. Might have been able to survive that, uh. That trial of his memories to the end. What I get? The trappers. So surpassing seal of flame repeater. Defeat. Oh, okay. So I already did one of the uh, vigil quests, essentially. Nice. Lucky for him, a certain famous fairy barge is still afloat. All right, I'm going to just gonna. Let me get rid of those turrets. This is our ferryman, and people have told me that these uh, characters are technically n are technically dead, but I'm going to keep assuming that there might be a way to save them. She sends some squirts crying home as she leaves port. Also, I am Nelly knows the way to the core. Super glad that we actually upgraded the. Maybe she can slip right past all the clamor on the coast. Super happy we upgraded the repeater because this is actually or maybe not super powerful now. A security skiff pulls up port side. Nelly's just another windbag to those guns. So. Just then, the windbags notice who she's sailing with. I feel like I'm a lot more powerful now, even though we did so poorly in the last in the last few episodes. I guess that's really the power of the uh, upgrading your stuff. They try to cut her off. These also might not be that strong of enemies now. I feel like I'm being a lot more powerful. They try to slow her down. This is kind of cool. This is kind of cool. It's like that other one where we had to. They try to knock her oh. out. Don't do that. That's not nice. Were we fighting that uh, in that gauntlet for the cage opening? You know, with the Ted's. Well, we Benelli tries harder. Try as she might, though, she hits a snag. Oh, what happens? Wow. Okay. Got to help her get untangled. Favors for favors. You got it. And we saved the fisherman, the little fairy guy, the fairy person. Is it a guy? Is it a? I don't really know. It could be either, actually. I am so happy with the decision to make this a more powerful uh, uh, weapon. And I am not this happy with- she picked a good spot for a break. It's the course right there. I am not happy with my decision to run into these with my face. Okay. Those things are really powerful. So there's an arsenal there. There we go. Whew, that was. Uh, I don't really need to use it though, because I have. I have pretty much what I want to have on equipped for right now. But it's good that there isn't one. But it also means it might be a bit of a longer stage. Oh, the core's right here. Hey, buddy, didn't you just kill a turret? All right. Uh. Then the kid hears an unusual sound. Like a hundred flapping wings. Well, yep. Yeah, so here's Beckers. here's a new enemy type. But luckily, the repeater is awesome. And I'm going back this way now. Okay, I guess I guess that's what I need to do. Not really sure. They've been watching us every move. But the gas fellows don't like him either. <laughs> so that's kind of interesting. So now I have enemies attacking other enemies. Which I can use to my advantage, I'm pretty sure. They had their own eyes on the core. But why? They're birds, who cares? They ain't got time to think it over just yet. I mean, I guess it's a good question. Finds a weeping Nelly raring to go. Is Bastion based on Alfred Hitchcock's of the birds? Is the calamity the ending of the birds? Ah, uh, and the fairy guy's dead. 
Also, these guys are my friends Turns now. Out she's got a special surprise for when the waters get rough. So hooray, turret friends. I shall call you Sally. She's gonna need a little help with all And Tally. Riders. Sally and Tally, that's their names. Traffic things think they're king of the roost now. Well the rest of us only wish we could fly in times like these. This repeater is is too helpful. <laughs> I mean <laughs> It's too helpful. It's it's good. It's very useful. Goodbye. Uh, not all of them are dead, but most of them are. Ah, hey, hey, get off my ship. Security skips keep on coming, starboard side. Oh, but not these. These turrets are bad. Seem to care what they shoot, as long as they hit something. All right. Now we're having a problem. Okay. Well, that gas wants to kill a turret. That's fine. But uh, the turret is still alive, which is a problem. Windbags getting even better. What's their idea? Oh, just to freaking hijack the ship. Well, it all proves too much for poor Oh no, we're losing our ship. Bye, ship. And it's go it's speeding up. <gasps> All right, where are we going, Nelly? She's just gotta make one last stop. Where's that? The Bastion? No, here. With her last breath, Nelly gets the kid with solid. Thanks, ground. Nelly. Solid ground in the Picker country. They want that core real bad. Why? It seems a calamity entered the Picker's appetites. Okay. Oh. Kid shoes him off, knowing they'll be back. Know how many times Kid nearly fell off the barge back there? A good couple of times. What's up? Now, listen close. You should remember this next part. What's going on? As opening, what's in here? Why go to Prosper Bluff? Oh, so now we're actually on a new stage. And Used to take an enterprising man, or plain old fool, to venture out that far. Well, well, we are a fool now because we are in the Prosper Bluff. There was more to that stage up there, actually, and I kind of missed it. Unless this is kind of the idea. The city was the most beautiful place in the world. We all knew that. The, the idea of it to kind of, um... But on the other hand... Split you up. Some folks just yearn to see the things they're told they can't. And that's why you go to Prosper Bluff, ain't it? Okay. And these things also damage me, so let's... let's... ow. Let's make them not be there, is what I'm trying to say. Also, there is a railroad system, apparently, at some point during the history of these... Yeah, the kid here's something he ain't heard in a long while. Who is that? How's it go again? Is that someone, or is that... Is that just an echo in his head? There's someone here. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, boy. Okay. Now it's actually singing, so yes, there is someone here. <laughs> oh, snaps. Be a little more quiet, because I kind of want to... Where this is coming from? Game, I know how to defend. I'm sorry, I'm bad at it, but I know how to do it. Am I getting closer? Oh boy, this is getting really exciting. Apologies for going quiet, but like seriously, I'm I'm very invested in this. 
as we kill all these annoying birds. Go away. No. Hey! Dumb birds. Sweet! There's a big one over here, isn't there? Yeah. There he or she slash it is. And there it goes. That upgrade for the healing was the best one I could have made. Best decision. This doesn't seem safe. I can't get over there. Okay. Now I can! Aha! These guys make, like, Banjo-Kazooie noises. <laughs> Alright, actually, I want to see what's over here before I move on. Oh, is it just... Did that open to go up here, which just leads to... healing. Okay. Nothing too important, but... Nonetheless, pretty nice. Alright. So I do apologize, these, ep these recent episodes have been a bit longer. I have been trying to keep them to a certain length, but... We're here. Let's figure out the mystery. Alright, is that... Is that I come this way? Oh man, I'm getting confused. Of where I have and haven't been. No. Just... no. <laughs> Dumb birds. Well, no point explaining what happens next, right? Suffice it to say, kid ain't coming home empty-handed. Is the journal singing? <laughs> I mean, that sounds silly, but... Stranger things have happened. A memento, a worn-out handbook written in traditional Earth script. Amid the scrawled notes, the book contains various indecipherable scientific diagrams, drawings, and mathematical formulae. And besides, it's like the song goes... We found someone! They'll be here before too long. The singer agreed to return to the bastion. We're finding more survivors! Awesome! We darn near celebrated when the kid got back, didn't we? Zolf never thought he'd see a fellow her again. She's cute. We become fast friends. Calamity has that effect on people. I like the Ura's clothing. That's really cool. But there was more to be done. There was one last core to find. Wait, what? We're close to the end of the game? Anyway, I know we'd end the episode off here, but actually, let's talk to everyone before we stop. Ask Zolf about this. A scientific journal written in Zolf's native tongue. He learned so much from it. Too much. Okay. If only I'd known half the secrets of the Calamity were tucked away in that book. I'd have worked to translate it right You away. can read it? Okay, that's interesting. And her name's Zia. All right. Most of the Ura never got a taste of Ceylandia's fine goods. Unless they were born and raised in the city like Zia here. Interesting. Sure, the world's all gone to pieces farther than the eye can see. But leave it to this gal to point out the hmm. amazing view. Girl tried to run away from home one time. But the marshals stopped that, didn't all right, they? so she has a bit of a backstory, too. So many secrets in there, and she can't even read it. Her father's own. Oh journey. wow! So because she was raised here, she doesn't know her. Own, she doesn't know the uh, language. Let's put in the last core. Just surprised when I tell him there's only one core left. I shouldn't have believed it. I'm surprised there. myself, but we'll have to uh, look into that next time. Thank you very much for watching this episode of Let's Play Bastion Blind. If you like this video, please consider hitting that like button below. And if you want to see more content from me, please consider subscribing. I hope you're having a great day, and I'll see you in the next one. Until then, ciao!